of mine. Field of I got like that was terrible. Was that what's the right way of saying that? Like a field, landmine field? Is that the right way right? Could be. Oh, that's nice equipment up here. I don't want to like mess with your stuff. Um, I enjoy being like my, you know, one little, you know, by myself upstate. So, you know, they were very gracious. They were like, hey man, can we move our stuff? I'm like, nah, you do, it's cool. So I like let myself I'll find a way to fit up there. I got a couple more songs. I got two songs. I played two songs. It's about the crackle and snaps. Um, I'm gonna play some. Um, so this song means a lot. I won't go into this whole story behind it, but um, I do feel like um, I do want to tell just a little bit of the story. The song's called "Stay With Me, Lover," and um, you know, a lot of people deal with anxiety, depression, and as a couple, you try to kind of. Some, some of you either are the the one, some, well not always, but like you, you may be the one or the other one is the person that you has anxiety. And sometimes you just don't know anything about it and uh, you can't explain it. The other person is just, sometimes you just gotta be the good person and deal with it. And um, sometimes you just gotta give a hug because you just don't know anything about what's going on, but you gotta be, um, you know, a partner to that person. And I wrote this song, I'm like semi-autobiographical, but um, I just felt like it was a good way to kind of help someone have to know that it was uh, it's okay to just, you know you don't you don't the person doesn't need to understand it right you just sometimes you just don't know how to your chemicals are just going to be a certain way but you know you just find a soulmate your twin flame or whatever it is and uh, this is one of those songs about just two people being in the world and helping each other out so the song's called stay with me lover Things might be on you. 
Burning 